All right, I'm over here at the Regal, and I'm going to see Here, starring Thomas the Hanks Engine. And uh, I've seen the trailer. It looks like it's going to be a little artsy, like they uh, don't move the camera a lot. They're doing the whole thing. So, uh, yeah, looks like it might be kind of interesting. So whenever I get back out to the car, I'll let you know what I thought about it. I go to the movies. Who would have thought? So here's my opinions. My opinions don't matter. Your opinions don't matter. What? We just put our opinions on the internet. It's what we do as a culture. No one knows why we do it, but we can't seem to stop. So for what it's worth, I'm the Joshua Lukoku, and these are mine. Here, starring Thomas Hanks a Million. Yeah, he, uh, he is in this movie. And I, I think I recognized the guy that played his dad, you know? But, uh, I can't really think of what that guy's name is. But they all do a very good job. So this movie, apparently it's a comic book movie. What? I had no idea. This uh, is based on a graphic novel. And I will put the, who made the graphic novel and all that in the, in the t hashtags and the, and the, you know, all those things in the comment section, that sort of thing. So, uh, yeah, so, yeah, it's, it's an interesting premise. They set it up, you know, it's like the camera doesn't ever move. And it's just this one spot. And it's like, and it goes all the way back to dinosaur times. And then there's like the Native American times and then the colonial times. And then, you know, different points during American history just from this one spot. You know, it, it talks about where it's, it's before the house was built. And, uh, you know, it's just looking at this other, other house and you're kind of in this driveway. And then eventually they build a house and, you know, a bunch of different people live there. And it's kind of like... It's an interesting idea, is what it is, but it mostly involves, uh, there, what, that, this is also the thing, it involves a bunch of different families, and I guess you could, like, do this story, and it have, be entirely about the Native American story, and you could do the, in, this, this story, and it'd be entirely about, uh, these weird hippies that are living there at some point. And then there's, uh, you know, there's the story about the prim and proper wife and her, her husband who flies airplanes, you know, like, and airplanes have just been invented or something. So, and there's all these different families, but it mostly involves the, the family of Tom Hanks, but it starts with his parents. So his parents live in there, and then you see... Tom Hanks is a little baby, and, you know, he's a little, little boy, and then, you know, he's a teenager. And that's when you recognize him, finally. And it's like, uh, you know, they make him look young. They use the AI to make him look young. And it's a real good job, you know. It's pretty impressive, and they show. And then, you know, it's just kind of about how he lives in this house, and they don't explain it what's going on, but, you know, like, initially, shouldn't be really a spoiler, but uh, you know, they, they move into with the parents, because they're so young when she gets pregnant, is the idea, so they move in with the parents, and so, you know, it's a, it's a communal sort of living situation sort of deal going on, but then they even do a point in, in, like, the future, where, they don't live in the house anymore, and this other family lives there. And so there, you could, like, have just the movie from their perspective if you wanted. This is really, really interesting, you know? It's kind of weird how it all goes down. So. But I thought they did a really good job, you know? It's, it's a movie, it's about relationships and emotions and about, uh... You know, uh, the decisions you have to make, you know, you have your hopes and your dreams, but you have the decisions that you make to, to just make it through life. And, you know, and how that, that, uh, 
changes your relationships and stuff like that. It's kind of interesting. But, uh, they, they kept doing this thing where it was like, you would move through, well, you don't move through times, like the camera doesn't move, but they would do di these different cutouts where they'd make different squares, you know, like panels in a graphic novel or comic book, you know, that sort of thing. And so it was, it was interesting, you know, so you, you could have a frame with multiple different time periods or you could have the, the whole shot, you know, and then there's different time periods and you could see, you know, how things, I guess you could say, sort of echo through time or, you know, different things like that. And so it's kind of, kind of, it's amazing. All the different things that can happen in a house in one room. And then they'll, there, there's, there's a time where uh, someone's moving a piece of furniture with a mirror on the back of it. So you get to see the other side of the room behind the camera. It's like, oh, well, there you go. That's what that's what was there the whole time. <laughs> so that's kind of fun. But, I mean, the acting was good. Some of it, it really does come off like a stage play. And maybe that's just because, you know how things are how it's stationary you know but I, it even felt like sometimes the acting was coming off like a stage play which isn't necessarily bad but it's it's not what you're used to from movie dialogue sort of thing but i thought some of it was witty you know some of it was fun and funny and there there was emotions and feelings and whatnot so, I mean, it's an, it's an interesting little movie. It's a cute little movie, you know? So, and I mean, there's nothing really much more to talk about it, but it, you could go watch it if you want to, and maybe you, it will give you feelings, make you think about families and stuff. Yeah. Those are my first thoughts after seeing here. I'm putting them up on the thoughts and opinions pile. They'll soon be buried by everybody else's thoughts and opinions, you know? So, uh, go ahead and tell me your thoughts and opinions. Yeah, put them in the comments section. Uh, like, subscribe, ring the notification bell, all the good stuff. Don't forget to feed your cat. And, uh, you know, don't forget to take your wife on a trip. <laughs>